pilot, fell asleep, then missed their landing in Hawaii. Have you ever wondered about the hidden side of air travel? Flying, with its sense of wonder and excitement, holds more than meets the eye. However, there are many secrets behind the cockpit door that pilots aren't allowed to share with passengers. Some of these rules are in place for safety reasons, while others are meant to keep passengers calm. Let's dive into some surprising things pilots aren't allowed to tell you. Today, we'll look into some of these lesser-known aspects of flying that pilots usually keep under wraps. Napping at 30,000 feet, one of the best-kept secrets in aviation, is that pilots do occasionally sleep in the cockpit. Yes, you heard that right. On long-haul flights, airlines have strict protocols in place to ensure both pilots are not simultaneously asleep. Typically, on flights lasting over 10 hours, you'll find a third pilot, known as the relief pilot, who takes over while the main pilots catch some shut-eye. This ensures that even during the longest and most grueling flights, there's always a pair of well-rested hands at the controls. The Ice Cube Puzzle If you've ever wondered why some frequent flyers avoid ice in their drinks, it's because of a little-known fact about airplane water. The ice on board is often derived from the airplane's water supply, which, while regularly tested and treated, may not be as pure as bottled water. Therefore, some passengers opt to play it safe and skip the ice. The uniform, a symbol of prestige. While passengers might think pilots' uniforms are just about looking sharp, they serve a much deeper purpose. These uniforms command respect and instill confidence in passengers. Seeing a pilot in a crisp uniform with stripes on their shoulders gives a sense of safety and professionalism. However, some pilots joke that the uniform is more of a relic from the glamorous days of early aviation, much like something out of Catch Me If You Can. Hydration, a balancing act. Pilots are well aware of the importance of staying hydrated, but using the bathroom on a flight is more complicated for them than for passengers. Regulations require that there are always two people in the cockpit, so if one pilot needs to use the bathroom, a flight attendant must take their place temporarily. To avoid frequent trips to the bathroom, many pilots manage their fluid intake carefully, balancing hydration with the practicalities of their job. Autopilot. Contrary to popular belief, pilots are not hand-flying the aircraft for the entire duration of the flight. Modern commercial aircraft are equipped with highly sophisticated autopilot systems that handle the bulk of flying, especially during cruising altitude. This allows pilots to focus on monitoring the flight, managing systems, and preparing for the critical phases of takeoff and landing. While some may see this as a shortcut, it actually enhances safety by reducing pilot workload and fatigue. Reading material. You might be surprised to learn that pilots are allowed to read during flights, but it's not what you think. Regulations permit pilots to read operational manuals, checklists, and other flight-related materials. Newspapers, novels, and other non-essential reading are generally discouraged to ensure pilots remain focused on their tasks. So, while your pilot might not be diving into the latest bestseller, they are constantly updating their knowledge to ensure a safe flight. Fuel management. One of the myths about flying is that planes are often light on gas to save money. In reality, airlines adhere to strict regulations regarding fuel requirements. Pilots must ensure there is enough fuel not only to reach the destination, but also to account for potential diversions and holding patterns. Additionally, pilots and dispatchers can request extra fuel for added safety margins. So, rest assured, your flight is well equipped with the necessary fuel to handle various contingencies. Lightning strikes. It's a fact that commercial airplanes are struck by lightning more often than you might think, typically about once a year per plane. However, aircraft are designed to handle lightning strikes safely. The electrical charge typically travels along the aircraft's exterior, exiting through the tail. While a lightning strike might cause a loud noise and some temporary discomfort, it's generally not dangerous to the aircraft or its occupants. Shared flights. When you book a flight with a major airline, you might not realize that your flight could be operated by a regional partner. These airlines, flying under names like American Eagle or Delta Connection, are contracted to operate flights on behalf of the larger carriers. While this might seem like a lesser-known fact, it's printed on your ticket and is a common practice in the aviation industry. The Secret of the Oxygen Masks If you've ever paid close attention to the pre-flight safety briefing, you know about the oxygen masks that drop down in case of cabin pressure loss. You might be surprised to learn just how much of the time autopilot is used during a typical flight. In fact, up to 90% of the flight. What you might not know is that the oxygen supply in these masks lasts for about 15 minutes. 
This is typically sufficient time for pilots to descend to a lower altitude where passengers can breathe normally. While this might sound alarming, it's a carefully calculated measure to ensure safety in emergency situations. Turbulence and weather. Phenomena. Turbulence is a common occurrence during flights, often causing passengers to grip their armrests nervously. Pilots, however, are trained to handle turbulence and are more concerned about severe weather phenomena like microbursts and wind shear, which can occur near thunderstorms. Modern aircraft are equipped with advanced weather radar systems that help pilots detect and avoid these dangerous conditions. Medical certifications pilots undergo extensive medical examinations to ensure they are fit to fly. These checks occur every six months for pilots over 40 and annually for younger pilots. While some pilots might have medical conditions, they must be properly managed and certified by aviation medical examiners to ensure safety. This rigorous oversight ensures that only healthy and capable individuals are in the cockpit. The economics of flying. The notion that pilots are underpaid might be true for regional airlines, where starting salaries can be quite low. However, pilots for major airlines typically earn six-figure salaries, reflecting their extensive training and responsibility. While the pay might not be as glamorous, good codes that pilots are announcing over the speakers for the cabin crew. Four-digit squawk codes are used to alert flight crew of emergency situations. As it was in the early days of aviation, it still provides a comfortable living. Love for landings. Many pilots have a particular enthusiasm for landings. This phase of flight, requiring skill and precision, can be one of the most satisfying parts of the job. Each landing is unique, influenced by factors like weather, runway conditions, and aircraft weight, making it a rewarding challenge. In-flight announcements. The announcements you hear during a flight are carefully crafted to keep passengers informed without causing unnecessary concern. Pilots and flight attendants use coded language and calm tones to communicate situations like turbulence or delays. The of ever having an emergency situation is extremely rare. The goal is to ensure passengers remain calm and confident in the crew's abilities. Secret rest chambers. On long-haul flights, pilots have access to rest areas known as crew rest compartments. These secret chambers, often located above or below the passenger cabin, are equipped with beds and provide a quiet space for pilots to sleep. This ensures that pilots can rest properly during long flights, maintaining alertness and performance during critical phases of the journey. So next time you board a flight, you'll have a newfound appreciation for the world behind the cockpit door. Projected flight arrival to avoid late landings. Adding a few extra minutes to the flight schedule keeps the pilots and the airlines record of on-time arrivals looking its Pilots, with their rigorous training, adherence to safety protocols, and sometimes surprising practices, are dedicated to ensuring you reach your destination safely and comfortably.